Hello everyone, I'm a revolutionary mocha lover, and thank you for joining me here on Old World Blue. So last time we took out the cartel here, the Sinaloa cartel, and we're looking pretty darn large in central northern Mexico. Um, in this episode we shall go ahead and almost immediately go to war with the Free Fighters because... Why not? We have 33 divisions, our manpower is a little bit lacking. And that's okay. We can improve upon that. We will demand our rightful territories. Yet, yeah, I, I still haven't figured out which nation that is. It's not Santa Ana. It is not Moctezuma, I believe. Um, so, I think it's just the Free Fighters. And I'm not exactly sure which piece of territory we really have claims on. Yeah. Well, we'll do it anyways. We'll see what happens. Hope you're all having a great, great day. We just finished some long-range optics. That's great. Let us grab some messenger seagulls. I love the messenger seagulls. I'll keep getting more manpower. We're going to need it for the free fighters. How many divisions do they have? Las Tres Mascaras. A lot of manpower. Quite a few divisions. Now, I did some infantry up here to help defend and hold the line. They do have some anti-tank. And these guys do have some anti-tank over here as well. In some locations. Um, good. More divisions, more success. Oh, Pancho Villa, do you have an upgrade? No, you don't. That's okay. And do we have any planes? We currently have 38 tactical bombers. Very nice. And we need some more support robots. White Legs played War on the Sorrows, which is kind of weird. I usually don't see the Sorrows being that aggressive, but... They took out the Sky Reavers, too? Holy cow. Oh, there goes the Western Brotherhood of Steel. Alright then, very nice. Yeah, they're actually pretty large. They took out, was it Arroyo? And Klamath. Ooh, Guerrilla Tactics. Tactics. Very good, very good. Um, basic laser weaponry. It doesn't make sense for us to go with common weaponry, so let's go with basic laser weaponry. That'd be very nice. We need more population. We have a good amount of combat robots. Uh, this is still 20 combat with, which is nice. And actually, for our Guardia divisions, we do have plenty of demo companies as well as anti tank on them ourselves. We have a basic smeltery, very nice. What else can we throw on here? Naval modules, that'd be okay. New Vegas, Clear War, and Ashton. Alright, well, good luck, guys. We could go with engine advancements. What about robotics? No, it doesn't look like we can really do much with robotics in the meantime. That's okay. Scrap motorcycles, maybe? More? Ooh, demo stuff. Reliability, platoon reliability. You know what? I always choose volatile explosives. Let's go with operational security, just because we can. Come on. I don't want to go to war until I have a decent amount of manpower, though. And let's let that division move on first. Ooh, worker militias. Nice. Zapata's worker militias, which gives us 2% more population. Moctezuma must fall. Perpetual revolution. Claims on all of Mexico. Less monthly population for more construction speed? Could be worse. Vehicles, robotics, robotics. Um, power to the people, anarchist electronics. Let's go ahead and do... Uh, build high-end robots because we will get that tech eventually and I want to make sure we're ready for it. So, Tlaloc let his children deploy only his more primitive robots. Oops. Dressing none of them to fully manage Mexico. But he's not around anymore, is he? No, he's not. I didn't mean for this to go over one day. But we're done with, done with our land doctrine. Awesome. Awesome. We're done with our land doctrine. Next up, rocket launchers. Um, We're not really fighting robots in the current moment. Let's get some more research speed. How about that? I don't want this robot to get over to where it needs to get first. This will be fine. These guys should be fine as well over here. So I'm not really too worried about it. And are you going to stay there? Good. Three, two, good enough for me. Oh, you're fighting Nueva Atzalan as well. That's right. All right, so they're going to attack us immediately. They are going to, but go to send our bombers this way. And if we can, I'm going to tell you guys to be balanced when you attack. And I don't want the infantry to attack. Now, can they pierce us in some locations? Yes. But it looks like it doesn't really matter. Are we getting some more air XP? Yes, we are. Very nice amounts. 
could be better, but you know, whatever, doesn't really matter. We do have a lack of combat robots, which is okay. Um, I do want to go to war with these guys next, perhaps, or Las Granjas. How many divisions do they have? It's not bad. We will have to fight over a river, which I really don't like. But we're going to fight over a river, whoever we attack. Attacking the ranchers would be a very bad idea right now. Because it's a very, very condensed area where we would have to attack. Uh, we do have bombers, though. Pecos Colony. We might be able to take Pecos Colony before Kaiser gets to them. But I don't want to risk a war with Kaiser. So Las Granjas might be the best case scenario for us. Unless we go to war with Santa Ana. They do have robots. Hmm, Death of the Father. Steel Legions. Well, let's try Las Granjas, because we can. And I'm not... I'm going to manually justify on them, because... We are nowhere near the focus tree completion to get down to... Liberate the South, or the Perpetual Revolution. So, Los Ejercito Mexicano declared one who have outlined. So you guys... You're, everyone here is killing at Moctezuma, except for these guys, but they decided to go to war with Moctezuma. Or, I mean, Nueva Atlan under the speaker. Now, they have a ton of manpower, holy cow, and a good amount of divisions, while Santa Ana has a good amount of divisions and a little bit of manpower. Sa Moctezuma is coming back. Huh. The fall of New Reno. Oh, the Shogunate took him out. Nice. Um, actually, it would be a, probably a smart idea for me to go to war with Ejercito Mexicano for right now, but that's okay. I'll let him wait. I'll wait on that. Guys, just go ahead and attack. I kind of don't mind it now. We'll get more army XP. We'll get even more air XP, potentially. We're still training our ships somehow. Ooh, our infantry is getting attacked as well. That is not very bueno, I would say. But that's okay. Uh, how many men have they lost? They've lost 1,000. We've lost 27. We've got cooling systems for even more breakthrough for our robots. We could do better stuff like that. Naval warfare... Air warfare. Hmm. I'm about to sneeze. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Excuse me. Holy cow. Hmm. I spy an encirclement here. Would it be possible? Potentially. Perhaps a small encirclement. Messenger seagulls. Very nice. Very, very good. More optics? Sure. Come on, take that toss. We can at least encircle three divisions. Come on, make it so, make it so. I'm kind of surprised you're not actually over there yet. Ah, oh, the false Shady Sands. NCR is wounded, but not yet mortally. Well, it's only one division, but whatever. Good enough, you know. Wow. We could expel the Rift Rap, but we're okay. Um, for our political power, I... Ooh, no, darn it. I do want to start coring a bunch of territory here. And con connect stuff. Oh, oh it costs energy. It doesn't cost us political power. That's pretty nice. In time, we'll probably do all this. Not yet, though. Um, just because I gotta keep an eye on our energy. Eh, maybe we do one. Whichever, it doesn't really matter. So we just gained about five, a little less than 500 manpower. It's not bad, could be worse. And I do have my cooperative coffee here. So... Time to drink up. Awesome. Awesome. Coffee, coffee, coffee. Oh, another encirclement. Very nice. Pancho Villa. You know he's a great general when, like, a quarter of his divisions are just, like, veterans. Camel survivors declared one with their nomads. Last time we saw the North Pole enclave, but they were defeated. The NCR is really not looking good right now. Oh, but we have high-end robots. Good. Now let's go and do... I want to get down to the Perpetual Revolution. So, Moctezuma must fall. Moctezuma thinks he can unite the Mexica. Or the Mexicans. But the real bonds stem from class solidarity. Let's knock out this pretender. And who is this red guy? New Victoria? Oh, New Vic wow, they actually navally invaded. Whoa. Now, Waifu is here. Queen Victoria the Sixth. Hello, Waifu. And... Ooh, basic laser weaponry. Very good. Very good. Um, what do we want? We get, we get this ahead of time. Sentry bots, heavy lifters, assault trons, speed, vehicles could be good. Rocket launchers, just because we're already using them. We might as well. Yeah, that's a strong brotherhood. White legs have gotten very large. Holy cow, they've even taken out 
the original home of the Sorrows. What is Kaisar doing? They seem to be just kind of stalling. Conquer of the 86. Damn busters are still there. Robots are doing great. Oh, I forgot to tell you guys to keep moving. Even though supply probably isn't super great around here. Uh, we still have a pretty good, decent amount of range on those guys. Basic weaponry, very nice. We're doing so well in supplies right now. What else can we use? What are we building? We're building up a lot of infrastructure, which is nice for more resources, but... Could we use it for something else? What's our metal like? Metal's okay for now. Build up a run of civilian factories as well as military factories. There you go. As you continue to build up more and more and more and more. Khazar's Legion to clear one of the dam busters. Very nice. Take the capital of Los Muchis. Oh, it's ten divisions. We're attacking with two. That might not go as well as we hope. Might not. Oh, we definitely took a few hits here. We definitely, definitely, definitely need more support. Robots. Bump you up by 10. That'd be good. Nice. Take these guys. Oh, they... Holy cow, they all died. 8,000 losses. Very nice. Operational security. Very good. Next up, grenade rifles. Sure. We don't need to take that much more territory away from these guys. Uh, but... Causing casualties is a little bit fun, not gonna lie. Next up, ship designer. Um, we're doing some research stuff. That wouldn't be too bad. Uh, armor, I think that these divisions, robots, are considered tank divisions. So if it's 26.3 armor... Actually, no, let's, go, let's check out this one. So if it's, yeah, 28.2, 28.2, and we slap on this guy, the new divisions should be higher than 28.2 in time theoretically cool uh, let everyone actually come over here and do this from behind that'd be great thank you very much uh, hold do that you guys come over there free states remnants were annexed I've never seen the free states really succeed and that's okay do these guys have any um, manpower the free fighters will become well Zapata supporters. I, neo anar, narco Zapatismo supporters. Ah, uh, Pacho will be a great guy. Chester, you get no, no upgrades? Do you have anything? Oh, it doesn't matter. Free fighters, thank you for joining us here. Beautiful. Let's let the bombers stop doing stuff for now. Oh, you're getting a little large for your hangar. I'll make you only 50 then. Oh, not 99. No, no, no. 50. Good, and I'll throw you right there, since you're going to be the main guy I use most of the time. Oh, wait, can you... Can I not attach you? Hmm. Interesting. Okay, well, whatever. Uh, revolutionaries. You shop? Uh, I'm going to put, up oh, like, five divisions up here. Creme de la creme up there. Two, three. Ah, three should be good right there. Three more come right here. Three more right here. And then, one, two, three. Good. Um, I'm not going to put a ton of divisions here because we don't have that many more. Sorrows have been annexed. That's fine. Two right there. And I only have three left for this, which isn't quite ideal. Which is fine. I can throw all 11, like, right there. There you go. Very nice. In time... Build up all these areas. We're going to need a lot of supply through here. Maybe. Someday. I don't know. Hmm. Looking pretty good. Tons of supply. Tons of supply. Tons of resources. That's the main reason why we do this. Resource central. Awesome. And looks like something's happening. Dam Busters was annexed by Kaisar. Benjamin has no upgrades, but he's level 4. He is a level 4 general, which is good. We have optic filters. We are going to get some signal flags next. 
ships. I need to actually probably research triremes soon. Probably next. We'll research some triremes because we don't have too much else here. Ores. Nothing here as well. Long range optics we can throw on now. Mouth. Word of mouth. That's pretty much all we can really do. Go ahead and just immediately change you to that. That'd be fine with me. You guys. Stop training. All of you. Just go and upgrade, I guess, for now. I really don't care. Get rid of the convoys soon enough. Yep, go ahead. Get rid of them. Nice. That'd be fine. Moctezuma must fall. We'll do next. Break the army. Santa Ana thinks he can run Mexico, but let's show him the army serves of people, not the other way around. I'm not going to go to war with Mex <clears throat> Santa Ana yet. That'd be kind of crazy. Well, you will get the war goal against them, but I want to take a Las Granjas first. I think that'd be... A little... No, wait, hold on. A little better. Hold on. Ah, I gotta wait to get triremes. So be it. So flippin' be it. Old World Tech? What could help us, maybe? Yeah, keep building those support robots. We need a lot of them. Demo equipment's very nice. Very, very nice, actually. Extremely nice. Um, Don't really want to change it, though. I mean, we're doing pretty well on all this stuff. Uh, repairs? Eh, uh, really only one. You really only need one. Ashton, god dang, there's been a lot of expansion. NCR is looking really bad. The Scorpions are doing a great job. The Western Brotherhood is kind of faltering. The Scorpions are doing exceedingly well. Holy cow. Ooh, we got rock, rocket launchers. Scorpions, what's your strength like right now? You're about to run out of manpower, which isn't ideal. That might not be very good. Rocket launchers, very nice. Let's grab some rotary engine bombers. That's a little bit ahead of time, but I don't care. Industry. More metal. Well, we could do more metal in the future. Um, naval modules, because screw it, why not? String telephones, because why not? Energy. We got not more energy. Can I core something else? As long as it doesn't... Connecting to ChicoNet is kind of nice. I don't have to spend political power to get it, which is honestly pretty, pretty darn nice. Uh, do we have... Supply issues. No, we don't, which is ideal. Quite ideal. We have a little bit of low manpower. I don't like that. <clears throat> now, what about these planes here? Oh, nice. Can I throw another 15? Yes, I can. Go up to 50. Thank you. That'll be delightful. And then I will attack here with uh, close... Not close air support, but bombers. How many more days do we have... <clears throat> Excuse me. Until we can go to war with these guys. They're on early mobilization. 40 divisions, new schools, loyal population, labor treaties. We don't have that much more time. Awesome. Give me about another day. Let's go ahead and go to war with them. Will they try to fight us? Oh, they will. So send you down here <clears throat> to do this first. Just in case they want to continue to attack us. All right, they're done attacking us. Cool. Now, I'm going to be careful when I attack, because some of these locations that we have, they're not super strong. But we should be okay. <clears throat> we have a war goal against Moctezuma, which is fine. We've already made it across here. Very nice, very nice. Go ahead and raise it up a level. They can't really do very much against us. They've suffered 800 casualties. Can they pierce us? Not, probably most locations they cannot. Which is good, just don't get encircled. Please don't get encircled. Awesome, you're doing a great job so far, guys. They suffered a thousand losses, we suffered 26. We have grenade rifles. Common energy weaponry. Let's grab some platoon training because we can. Awesome. Oh, break the army, and then we will do <clears throat> the perpetual revolution once we have killed off. Santa Ana, which we'll attack next. Next, though, how oh, we get some more power? Zapata will light the way towards a brighter tomorrow. Absolutely. There you go. Now go ahead, my friends. Go ahead. You know what? Just go crazy. That's fine with me right now. The people in the north will lead the way, basically. Uh, you guys might not be able to. Go ahead and hold. Don't leave that tile. Because I don't want anyone to get encircled. 
as we're waiting for the northerners to, well, the north easterners to finish up what they're doing over there. Light signals? Sure, because why not? Good, we have Chihuahua. And we just encircled like five divisions on the right side, the more eastern side, and they're dead. Oh, we made an encirclement here too. Nice. Good job, guys. Mm, factories? What do we need? I mean, we're pretty good on a lot of stuff. Let's get more bombers, because we can, and we need more scrap metal now. Uh, we built those military factories. That's kind of nice. Let's see, we're place for 70, 9, 11. Uh, cool. Cool. Oh, we're about to get defeated here. That's not ideal. What's that in the infantry now? They should fall... Relatively soon-ish. As long as these divisions can keep moving up. That's what matters. Um, this is disgusting. This is really, really disgusting. So. You know what? Do it with that too. These groups. There you go. We have another group of light robots. Which is very good. Come up here immediately. I'll put you under someone new. Thomas Jenkins. Very Hispanic sounding name. Very Hispanic. Um, maybe I should say Tomas, but even then. Go to see we died. I'm not sure what that means. I think it means fort, perhaps. Cool. Very nice. Very nice. We get about 1.08 political power a day, even though it seems like we've been getting a lot of political power. Oh, good. Oh. I can't lower that. Okay. Just take all states. Very nice. Well, Maximilian, or Santa Ana, really. Your time is up. You have support robots, which isn't good for us, but that's okay. Uh, I'm going to put my infantry over here. I'm going to put the main robot army right here, which would be great. You guys will... Uh, this is really not ideal. I won't go to war until I have a few more robots over here, because I want to send the infantry... This way. A very aggressive Santa Anna. Um, I guess just beef up that one a little bit more. Yeah, beef them all up a little bit more. That actually works out pretty nicely, actually. Pretty darn nicely. And of course, the honorary custom of let's build more infrastructure. More and more infrastructure. Very good. Divisions. Glowing ash. Ooh, we have coast guards. That's good. You guys come there. You guys come there. Uh, increase you by one. Guardia divisions looking beautiful. Oh, we have maintenance companies. Um, actually, you know what? Let's throw one on. This hurts our armor. It hurts our piercing just by a little bit. We take more... We lose our capacity for energy cells. We get more equipment, ratio capture, more reliability, which is really nice. Let's do that. Good, good, good. Let time go on. We have our bombers here. They did a great job. Uh, Benjamin Sedgwick is injured or ill or something. I really wasn't paying attention. Let's get some triremes. Let's get the next bomber close by. Whistler was annexed. So be it. There's not a lot of air bases around here. Hmm. A potential problem. Do that. Oh, and make it level 2. Just in case. Mobilizing more. That's good. What is our energy cells like? We don't want to core too much more without enough energy cells. We're going to need more metal factories. Totally okay with me. What are the losses for Santa Ana currently? I really want to attack when they're really engaged. Um, Ejercito Mexicano. Mexicanos. You're not Mexicano. No, Los Ejercito, Mexicano. Huh. You were fighting Moctezuma, I didn't realize that. Oh, how's, how's this going? Nueva Atzlan versus Moctezuma, they've lost 3,000. Holy cow, they've lost 19,000 against Moctezuma? They're really eating um, their enemies in Moctezuma's lands. NCR's almost dead. Oh boy. Oh boy, 35,000 losses. Brotherhood against Old Country. That's quite a few losses, and then there's that. Let's see, what else do we have here? Uh, engine order telegraph, sure. And if we go to war with these guys, our navy should still be okay. 
as we're repairing. That's probably totally fine. Keep making more metal, scrap metal. Keep upgrading the ships because it doesn't really matter. That's why I didn't want to go to War with Pecos Colony. I might go to War with the Ranchers, or at least Genta del Sol. I'll probably go to War with Genta del Sol. <clears throat> That'd be probably pretty good to do. Boulder City Salvage. I want these guys to lose more. Lose, lose, lose more. Oh, and there goes Pecos Colony. The power to the people. Very good. Very, very, very good. Pre-war robots. Anarchist electronics. These electronics were made by a friendly workers collective with humane conditions. Not capitalist inhumane conditions. It's just that nobody's free to leave it. Ever. And they voluntarily, mandatorily do it. Hmm. Love it. Oh, discovery of old world tech. We get more encryption and decryption for four months. Not bad. We're getting more metal factories. We're building more civilian factories so we can build more stuff. That's kind of nice. Keep building that infrastructure. Um, if I were to attack now, that wouldn't be very good since I need more divisions right here. Just plop them out. I don't mind plopping you out early so that I, I can train you since this other division needs training as well. So, And as a reminder, how many men have these guys lost? 314. That isn't really that much. That really isn't much at all. Go ahead and train. Ah, rotary engine bomber. Very good. It's almost 2280, so construction, yeah. Yeah, construction, very nice, good stuff. Um, I really can't do much else. I guess I'll give you a little bit more reliability, perhaps. That's pretty much all I can do for you. Very nice, we got a little bit more of this. I might save it to go to War Economy, perhaps. That might be good for us to wait to do. Keep building up stuff. Keep doing this. Keep up. Oh, good, good. <clears throat> I might just rush out another set of divisions and then train them and then go to war. That might be the most ideal thing to do. Oh, good. good. Let them expand themselves out. Good. Good. Get down there. I don't want you to be green. Um. Oh, what do we not have? Oh, okay. Well, I guess we still have it then. Light signals, very nice. Let's go ahead and grab some miniaturized circuitry. Very good. Get down here, guys. Get down here. Hurry up. Move it, move it, move it. How slow are you? You're not that slow. Only four kilometers per hour. Um, planes. Do we have any more planes? No, we don't. No, we do not. That's okay. Keep repairing, guys. Keep repairing and upgrading your ships. Because even though you're only level one, that's still okay. That's still okay. As long as you're level one pretty darn fully upgraded. That's pretty important. Um, I'm not going to wait the entire time for these guys to get a ton of experience, so go ahead and wait. Get your organization, and then we'll begin an attack. Can I put you on here yet? No. My other planes are over here. Can I put you over here? No. Oh god. That's quite not ideal. Anarchist Electronics. Very good. Robotics for the people. Zapatos Human. Helpers. Humans are not slaves under Zapata. They are merely fellow travelers who need <clears throat> a firm helping hand. Ex exactly, exactly. You understand. Of course. Of course you guys understand. But we must explain to the ignorant who do not understand neo-anarcho-zapatism. Ooh, triremes. Support companies. Ooh, demo equipment. I love demo equipment. Industry. Let's go ahead and get some rapid prototyping. Very good. Very bueno. And, oh, we have a new division here. Cool. Go ahead and say goodbye to our other brother. And they immediately begin attacking us here. That's fine. Um, I don't mind deploying you guys in response to that. Go ahead and do that as well. And we are slowly getting more and more XP. Now, I don't want you to go crazy here, guys. But do have a good time with our brother's military. Are they going to attack us again? Please attack me again. I'd love for you to attack me again. For now, go just help them support the operations down here. Just give me all that air XP. I want as much air XP as possible. Pancho Villa. We just... Pancho Villa's great. I love Pancho Villa. Oh, Jester, do you have an upgrade? No, but you leveled up, I guess. Very good. Uh, yeah. Engine order telegraph. Very nice. Robotics. Speed. Hardness. More heart attack. Oh, sentry bots, yes. And get rid of these heavy lifters for more of those guys. We still can't go to war economy? 
We have to be at war, and an enemy country has to have 40% or more of our country's total number of factories. Dang it, we have to go to war with Khazar's Legion probably to get to war economy. Oh, uh, let's, let's go down from export focus to limited exports, just because I notice that we have insufficient resources. And holy cow, we got a lot of resources now. Nice. Going to start acquiring some of these territories is going to cost more every time we do it. It really doesn't matter too much. Oh, we just got like 2,000 more manpower. 6, 5, 7. 7, 2, 6. How much did that cost us? Um, excuse me, thank you. Oh, baby. Give me all that manpower. We might not need to mobilize for quite a while. If we keep doing this. Oh wait, hold on. That's a that's a huge cost. Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. That's a massive cost. 320 energy? Holy goodness. Holy cow. Um, you guys maybe need some more adjustment here, perhaps? Give them a little bit more time to build themselves up. Actually, they already have a ton of planning done. Can you not go, guys? Are you not smart? Please go. Please, please clap. Please, please give them the one to buckle my shoe. Oh, we can't come here, though. Cannot move to a location owned by Exxon. Uh, my brother, I am sorry, but not really. Go ahead, guys. Ah, uh, I love a good, a good brother's war. Oh, we got this territory, too. Radioactive tier. I love the radioactive tiers. Good. Um, this is probably not really worth doing right now. But just keep building up more civilian factories, and you know what? We haven't. We need some air bases up here. We're going to need an air base against Jetta del Sol. That's all good stuff to build. Good. Build this up up to when we get there, and keep building infrastructure. That'll be very very important to do. Ah, yes, very nice. Moctezuma. Oh, Moctezuma, you had so much potential. Resource-wise, we're doing very well. Very, very well. I might consider actually making these 40 combat width. You know what? I will make these 40 combat width. And I will throw on logistic companies on them as well. And now we must divide up our territory between us, Petrochico, and Nueva Atzlan. Unfortunately, I gotta keep click, 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 clicking. Alright, alright. And that's enough for now. Cool. Uh, no, that's not, I'm not going to be a total jerk. You guys get that. You guys can get not that. You'll get this as well. Petro Chico. Um. Oh, that's a lot. You can take New Leon, and I'll take San Luis Potosi. So that should work out fairly nicely for you. Oh, that's a lot of score. That's so much score. All right, Petro Chico. There you go. Hope you feel good about yourself, and I need like 101. Good enough, right? Now, I usually don't like doing this, but I am going to end the episode here because I have other things to get to. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this episode, guys. If you did, perhaps leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and tomorrow we'll finish off Santa Ana. We'll probably end up going to war with Petro Chico, and maybe end up at war with Gento Del Sol. Who knows? We'll see what happens tomorrow. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. I really appreciate it, and I hope you all have a great, great rest of your day.